Watch how I jump in the crowd. Watch how I jump in the crowd. A boozy bitch wipe me down. I almost lost now, foul. I pop a pill, nigga, wow. Oh, watch how I jump in the crowd. Oh, watch how I jump in the crowd. Oh, yeah, I'm so hot. Yeah, can't trust a bitch cause she bite. Pop me a pill that I'm high. I'm feeling like Tarzan. Whoa, I'm the man. Yeah, I'm the man. Pop me a flat and I'm saying. All right, yo. It's that, it's that, man. It's that, man. We here. With another video for y'all, I'm on my point four right now because I wanted to show y'all a little, a little trick I could do. So, we shoot, we here, man. Dub, this is a dribble cheese move, man. Yo, I'm pretty sure y'all already know about this. This been out for a while. That's it right there. I'm gonna teach you guys how to do it. So, you guys, you know, if y'all wanna cheese, we out here together, man. A lot of people can't stop this, man. A lot of people cannot stop this at all. So I'm gonna teach you guys how to do this double, uh, this little double behind the back move. It gives you a little speed boost. It's a little cheese move. I'm pretty sure this works for if you got like if you got a point for like me. You just get your playmaking up and you got your ball control, all that stuff up. So I'm gonna show you guys my stats. I don't play on this dude anymore, but I got my playmaking maxed out. This is how it's looking like. I don't know. I don't really play on this dude anymore. I don't take him serious. Uh, but he is gonna be a backup player for me. I'm focusing on my stretch big because you know I take my stretch big to the park, throw him and all that stuff. My demi guy. That's who it is. So if I go to inventory, inventory man, we gonna go ahead and we gonna go to where am I going? Well, we're gonna go to uh, NBA Pro Animation. We're gonna go to uh, dribble moves. Dribble moves. Here they are, man. This is what you need. What the hell? Oh, okay. This is what you need to have in order to do this double behind the back. Wait, mainly we're going to focus on. Well, no, you just need to have all this stuff on. This is actually the cheese, you know, the cheese loadout, I want to say. This is the loadout and the method, the guide to having the cheese removed. Like, this is the cheese loadout that you need to have in order to dribble around a lot to do all the cheesy dribble moves and all that stuff. But mainly we want to focus on the behind the back in this video. So, Welcome back, man. We're doing this behind the back stuff, man. So this is what you need to uh, have. You guys got a good look at it. We're going to teach you guys how to do it. It's pretty simple. If you stand at the top of the key, you just want to do double flick backwards of the right stick, and it will do that. It will. It's, this is so simple. Like This is how it's looking. Now, if you do it three times, you do, it's obviously going to get tired, start you know losing the ball a little bit. So that's what you want to avoid. You want to just flick it backwards two times. You just ran to the paint, man. Whatever guy you got, you know, if you got your ball control and you're playmaking up at a certain amount and you're able to do this, you can just pop a three. I can't make threes like that. But, you know, what I usually do is I do the double flick backwards, run to the paint, dunk on him, man. I'm trying to get posterized to doing this stuff. Like I said, I'm not really using this guy a lot, but I will hop on him a couple times. Do this a lot. Get him some ankle breakers, you know, get him some posterizer. Just run into the paint doing this stuff, so... That's what's nice about it, man. This cheese dribble move does give you a speed boost. A lot of people cannot handle it, man. If you take this to the park, do a little crossover like that, run to the paint. It's pretty simple. But again, the main focus is that you need to just flick the thing back twice. Or you can also do it once. And if you do it once and run to the direction that you throw the ball to. So, for instance, if I got it in my left hand, I want to do that. In my right hand, run to the paint, whatever it is, man. You're getting a speed boost. You're getting a boost that the defense cannot control or keep up with. Although they did just release a patch where you, you know, the defense isn't intensified. You can still do this, man. Just run to the paint, doing this double behind the back dribble move. I prefer doing flicking it backwards twice, so that works the best. So that's pretty much it, man. It's a simple move to do. But you guys saw the whole inventory that I have, man. The whole loadout that I have with cheesy dribble moves. That's the key function thing. The hesitation and all that stuff, man. It's all good to have that on. But anyways, man, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Make sure you do this cheesy dribble move in the park, man. Break some people's ankles. Get you some ankle breaker with this stuff, man. Do it to them. Do it to them, man. It's Stag Out Range, man. Thank y'all for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you have not subscribed yet. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed and it really did help you out. Just a little simple, easy, cheesy dribble move for you guys to do, man. It's pretty simple for you guys. So anyways, thank y'all for watching. I'm out.